trap is there. And deep with the head. And deep with the head and vegan. Hi. Ah, it's another of these cold rain days outside in the middle of the summer. Okay, I say all weather is blessing for yoga at least, you know. I want to be one, so yeah. On these days, I like something warm sometimes. I like raw food, light food. Oh, my very best. But sometimes I like cooking too. But in between, there is something also. It is raw, but warm. I have this wonderful piece. I want to show you a pea soup, a five minute pea soup. When I first found out it was so simple in five minutes, I make it delicious, beautiful pea soup. But there is another variation I want to share with you today. And it's the vanilla and a little bit of cayenne pepper. That's basically it. So I begin again, like before, with a shallot. Shallot. It's a gentle kind of, a, um, of an onion. So mellow, not that sharp, not that hot. It's easier to digest. And um, yeah, but they're a little bit more expensive. So you don't need to dig them. It doesn't matter if you take a shallot. You just take a smaller piece. You just cut them into pieces. That's okay with a shallot and the blender. It makes it easy. I take the avocado. My second ingredient to make the pea soup, like many other soups, nice and creamy. I don't take that much of an avocado, maybe the smaller part of a half, because I will add some coconut butter. Coconut butter is one of the healthiest fats you can have. It's wonderful. It has amazing benefits. Uh, I take some, and it is a nice taste if you have it with a pea or uh, some strong seasoning. Yeah, yeah intense seasoning. Then the coconut is wonderful because it has its own flavor and it might uh, influence the taste. But with a strong flavor, <coughs> of the seasoning. It is always nice to take that. I have vanilla. I have my own raw vanilla. I found it in the internet. I take two teaspoons for half a pound of peas. But it's a vanilla taste. So I love that. If I take it a bigger quantity of vanilla, it's cheaper and I have it on stock. So where is my cayenne pepper? Should be some cayenne pepper in. But this is an only, I think it's not so, not, not, not much, only maybe an eighth, eight part of a teaspoon. Very small amount. Otherwise it's too hot and then the whole pea soup doesn't taste anymore. Peas are gentle, you know. Sweet peas. But always, the base of my, and always, of this pea soup, the base of the spice is always the black pepper. I cut it without only taking the, the cayenne pepper or the chili, but honestly, it didn't really work. I like to combine different kinds of peppers because they have a pepper is very healthy if you. If you have no problem with your stomach, it can be a little bit tough on your stomach if you take too much. But otherwise, it's, it's a very nice ingredient. The pepper is very healthy. There are lots of benefits. You can read it. The Indians, for example, Sri Ganapata Satcharanda Swamiji, he has many websites, and one is only for herbs and the, the benefits of herbs, healing, and taste, and everything. And um, I love the Indian science of the herbs, the Ayurveda. It is a wonderful knowledge and I'm always eager to read something. Pepper is very nice. You can use it in many, many different ways. So I have pepper and a little bit of cayenne pepper. Black pepper and cayenne pepper. That is most of it. Now the peas. 
It's a small quantity, four pounds. Just, it's not even half a pound. And my water. Ah, I forgot the salt. Without salt, this doesn't work at all. I have my Himalayan salt again. You see, this is like this one. You see, it's quite a amount. So yeah, we always just let it adjust a little bit later. The Himalayan salt has many benefits too. Our bodies need salt. They cannot survive without salt. And if you have a standard American diet or a regular diet, you have plenty of salt anyway. But I don't need any salt. I have only my fresh product, produce from the garden, the supermarket, from the um, health food store also, and uh, mostly. So there is no salt in it. Add it. Yeah. So water, a lot of water, to make a nice consistency, and now again, ears down, eyes up. Thank you.